Alright, Smorganites, good evening. Welcome back. For those tuning in for the first time, make sure everything's working here correctly. Microphone's good. Audio looks good. And we are... Ow. Ow. Little bat punk. Kitty gets tech on my feet. Uh, Alright, so we're containing the uh, Trial of the Disciple. I had to backtrack a little yesterday. Gonna climb my leg there, kitty cat. I forgot to do one thing. One second. Forgot to load up the stream on my phone. Uh, let's make sure the other thing's not being captured. Browser, 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 browser. Turn that off. There we go. Don't need another person stream playing online. Let's plug that in. Okay. Uh, I gotta take my friend real quick. Creeper, please. Okay, so we're on. The third part of this trial, well, all right, and of course, little vitamins here. My double little vitamin. Oh, mm, yeah, he's so handsome. He's so handsome. Mm. I'm gonna miss the day when you don't fit in my hands. Oh. No. You get down. Over there. All right. Jump up in here. Ah, I was so lazy to don't step on the keyboard. So we start all the way up there. So where are we going? Um, the goal is to make your way down to the uh, question, question, question. All the way down there, that little green dot. Um, first, make your way east to Phoenix Nest, where you'll find a chest containing aluminum essence. Can I not shoot you? Come on! Apparently, these guys can drop some claws, so maybe we'll get lucky here. Ooh, is that a rare one? Two on the cords. It's not a rare one. It says to go this way. No, definitely not a rare one. You after my. You're attacking everything. These are phoenixes. <clears throat> and they hit hard. Stop attacking. Don't play with their wires! You're clicking Let's stop. You silly kitty cat, lay down. Leave me alone! Alright, I got the file of luminescence. Luminescence. <gasps> Come on. You're tangled, and you're meshed, and you're doing stuff. Oh. You have my attention all day. It's raining here. All right. Um, so we're gonna try to get the kite, the kite claws. Go to the vines south where you started, and travel down the tunnel leading south.
Ah, right there. Alright, says I travel down the tunnel leading south. But don't go here yet, okay, go. West and south. Oh, Harvest Moon. Let's get cracking! Ah, I bypass it. There's a lovely dragon rider. Now I can fly wherever I want. You can easily continue to the glowing symbol, but you can also use it to easily explore the entire area. Check your map for the sparkly spots. Did I do all to right? you get them, you'll find some more calcum. Uh, treasure chest you also see a bot. Let's see. This is one of the two spots that you can farm or calcum. The chest in the cave contains... Alright, so since we got this thing... Ooh, a dragon bandana? that do? Uh, deafness. Absolutely nothing. Maybe it's good for Eric? Probably not. Yeah? Sacred armor is good. Minus 30 HP. Restore each turn. Minus 30 HP? Or plus 30 HP? Uh, it's outfits. Like the, the assassin look for him. I'm going to fly! Alright. So, bring up this map. We're going to fly everywhere and get stuff. So, starting with the east. Just right here. You got three mini metals, like I need more of those. We're gonna fly up this way. There should be a sparkly spot. Somewhere. Uh, what? There it is. We're gonna go in the key. There's uh, a few items. Just try to fight them. Sure, let's see what we can do, because everyone's getting that crap ton of levels. Like, I don't know what they did with it, but they get a lot. I think we're going after Pep Up, so we need 25 for him. Uh, 17, which I don't think is enough yet to get this last one. We need 20. Uh, 24. We need... That's 25. Uh, let's see, 32. Going for Harper Street. I'm of Earth. Hidden pen reveals holier. Increases the effectiveness of him. It's nice. What was that one? Divine intervention. Hmm. About to get that next round because I forgot. Um, seventeen fisticuffs. This is after claws, not claws. That is a lure. So we're gonna go for pep up power. Unlock that one. Sexy beam cannon. 
Uh, let's see, Rad Boy. I think you're going for Enlightenment. Because uh, I'm all. I think we're going Caster Sugar. Yeah. Pick up that. Can now pep up Rush of Blood. Mm, nice. All right, buddy. I have no idea what to do for you. I guess I'll just get the rest of these heroes at once. That's 20. That's 10. Yeah, another one. Um, yeah, five left, so 10. I'll get that one and unlock the other one. Right, everyone. Some of giant sword to a cave, yes. Alright. Justin's helm, very nice. Can I not be quick? There it is. Uh, let's see, that's gonna be for Hendrick. The other one changes the wearer's appearance when equipped with the Justin Justin's arm. It's beautiful. Right. Actually, gets an outfit. Uh, so we're going to fly down here. This little side cave over here. Whatever. You won't get away. More fighting means more experience. Oh, tight fitting. Veronica wins again. Let's see. Here. Oh. Uh, nope. 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 Alright, we gotta go the other way. I fly back down that way then. I'm not losing the mount. And don't come back. Right, going this way. Anyway, I should fight you at some point. Right down here. Fight me, Gaia Dragon. Looks mean. Oof, he hits hard. Oof, he hits real hard. Oof, you toughy. Anything either? That's fine. There's a sparkly spot down there. Might as well get it right here. 
Oh, a piece of redwood. Nice. Alright, where are we at? We need to go over that direction. It's fine, because we got to get this thing anyways. Hi, scorpion little thing. Come fight me. Thank goodness. I'm bored. I think they reduce the amount of HP you need for these things. Ow. Got that, got that, got that. So we need to go south. Berkeley squats over here. Oh. Down here. It should be a chest. Those would be a chest. Oh, it's right there. Got a book, a hero's book and better weapons. So I need to go over this way now. Is that campsite? Up we go, up we go. Look down here. Is there a rope? There it is. Oh. Mm. Whoops. Oh, hi, kitty. You jump up here fast now, don't you? Huh. Ah. Ah. <laughs> Vitamin says hi. Vitamin says hi. Come here. I gotta go in this cave. Three fireballs. Come on. Ow! Come on. Owie! Oh, brat! Get that one. Fight me. Just don't whack me. And don't come back. A lot of enemies up here. So we get this, and that'll be it. And we gotta head to the other spot. And don't come back. Uh, each of the coming trials, the final battle must be completed within a count of twenty-five. Most likely, we're home on the one. This one needs twenty-five to complete turns, which is fine. I'm strong enough for that, anyways. Vicious Griffins.
Alright. I don't think we get Drustins. Yeah, we don't get his armor set from this. Ah, okay. Run! Run! Owie! Damn cat, stop attacking me at random moments! He's doing what kitty cats do. You're pushing buttons, quit it. You're pushing buttons. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Come on, I'm so focused on the cat. Ugh. Crap. I'm glad I saved it. Me down. You're so sleepy earlier, why don't you sleep now? Justin's Labyrinth and Bolt. So, thou art come before me at last. Welcome, Luminary. Justin! Huh? Huh? you trust him? I am he, steadfast sword and trusted companion of Erdwin, luminary of legend. Kalasmos was vanquished, and his body sealed away in the prison in the sky. Thereafter, I did go forth and strive my utmost to rebuild this ruined world. Yea, I did found a nation, and its people did flourish under my rule. In time, that realm became known as Vard's Rust, for this was ah. where at last I did lay down my sword. There is a son of Vard's Rust among thy fellowship, is there not? Thy demeanor, thy bearing, thy frame. I, thou art one of us. This much is plain. That thou hast joined forces with the luminary just as I once did is no coincidence. Sir Drustin, can I ask you something? If you fought alongside Erdwin back in the Age of Heroes, how are you still alive? And what are you doing down here? The noble watchers aided me in the construction of my labyrinth. Tis a storehouse of the world's mightiest weapons, set aside for safekeeping, lest the Dark One ever return. When it was at last completed, I did cleave my spirit from my body, that I might await the Luminary's coming. And here thou art at last, Scion of Erdwin. Thou hast his eyes. The labyrinth was made in such a way that the strength of any entering might be sorely tested. Thou hast passed that test, and shalt be rewarded accordingly. When thou hast overcome the final trial. If thou art to conquer the Dark One, 
Thou must needs begin by besting the most insidious foe of all, thine own fear. Prevail in this endeavor, and none shall stand in thy path. But it is not a trial to be taken lightly. Prepare thyself, Luminary, as thou hast never prepared before. And when thou art ready, pray. Speak with me again. Thou art ready. Yes. Here we go. Line hatred oh, draws yeah. near. Tactics, fight. Show no mercy. Except for Serena. She shall fight wisely. Right, and fight! Question is, am I going to do it in 25 turns? Girl. There we go. Good job, Henry. We have carried the day. I salute thee, Vitamin. Thou just didst fight valiantly, but did thou smite the enemy in twenty-five actions of fewer, thereby passing thy trial? Thou didst victory with thine and mere sixteen actions. Verily, thou hast overcome a trial with a plump, a plump. Ah, I wish I had a super powerful weapon. I wish I could enter a top level horse race. I wish I could copy of Ogler's Digest. I wish I could change Serena's hairstyle. I wish I could pick someone to stay with me forever. Ah, powerful weapon. I wish for a mighty weapon. One to which thou might be easily defeat the Dark One. Yes. An excellent choice. Yeah, tis no less than I would expect of the luminary. Very well. I shall bestow upon thee a means of crafting a weapon beyond compare. Supreme Secrets of the Sword of Light. He reads it from cover to cover, learning its incredible contents by heart. I can make the Supreme Sword of Light. With the recipe in ancient tome and parteth, the Sword of Light will grow old. Surely grow more potent than ever before. Er, before. With such a weapon at thy command, none shall stand in thy path. Ah, I have a little reward of my own. Tis but a trifle. I uh, see that events. Thou hast overcome a trial. One trial, but there are sterner challenges yet await thee. When next thou returns here, I shall have th thee test thy strength against an even more fearsome foe. We do have ads coming up. Visit me again when thou art good and ready. Until then, fa fare thee well. Ooh. Ah, we have completed the first trial. Ladies and gentlemen, it is ad time, so I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Let's continue. Ah, right. What am I doing here? We need to do that. So, um, we have that, that. Uh, we should pick yada yada yada. So, a knight in shining armor, the final mini metal rewards and beyond. Since you now have access to infinite amounts of mini metals, you can easily stolen from certain enemies and cool keep 
Yada yada yada. The may already have 110, the final reward. Uh, the reward for 90, yada yada yada. The reward for 110 gives me all that. Uh, let's see, all these amazing pieces of gear. The Metal King shield is best shield in the game for Serena and Savando. So aim to make two of them at plus three when you're able to. The Metal King sword outclasses every other sword and wall attack. Aside from two others that are generally better suited for the hero. So aim to forge two of them for Eric at plus three. We'll set him on swords through the rest of the game. Although the Sword of Judgment and the Hell Sabers are still great defaults, for now, if you are using either of those, uh, while none of the weapons are the strongest in their class, they are very close to it and can put a hurting on enemies with them. If you get the recipe now or soon, you might need to wait for some other materials. You may find difficult forging, yada yada yada. <laughs> After you receive the final reward, you receive an alkalite, yada yada yada. Um, the winner here are Serpent Souls, wait, and Urb the Oop, Urb uh, Uber Agates of Evolution. You'll need a lot of Serpent Souls. Uh huh, I'm not worried about that. Additional metals are first. Oh, ten. Okay, so if you have additional metals, uh, you can buy the Uber Agates and Serpent Souls. Also, an easy way to obtain Saint Ashes if you need them. Next, we're going to Hendrix and Savando step up their game a bit. The line of events can be a bit of a pain to complete, but sets us up for success for most remaining boss battles in Act 3, Zumo to Porto Valora. So, for now, we need to... I forgot what we're doing. Oh, yeah. Aha! You can go right to the trial. Um, alright, so, we can go to, we can go to, where are we going? The Academy. And then after that, we'll see about making some weapons. Head to Porto Valor. Collect 110 stamps, making the things of metal kings. Long sword, great Groot swords and boomerangs. Yay! Completed! You've completed, filled out your album, the metalids. <laughs> this is magnificent. Miss me, I don't know. Incredible, even in years. Uh, you are the first person in the history of the Academy to collect as many metals in so minimum a time. I knew that there was a right there in road, you as an and an student, an RA student. But does it mean that your many metal collecting career is over? None! No, that your album is medalist, is complete. I think I said that right. I will exchange any metals that you bring me for a maximum, max, magnificent. Rewards of your choosing. Thus, shall change, Ian. I would have you collect more mini medals, just like you did before. Seek them out, pick them up, and bring them to me. <clears throat> so you get five for that one. Serpent souls for that one. Brag it. Alright, so, we need to hit up a, a camp of some sort. Uh, zoom over any 
camp will do. try to make some stuff. Now this thing stated. Bring the gear to the gears. A Metal King Shield is best for game for Serena and Sabando. Lots of fun things to make here. Ba -da -dum -bum -bum -bum. Lots of fun stuff. Look at these. Stead poker. Straight poker. Oh, these are upgradable. Super Nubu sword. And three of those. So I want a stud poker. Not worried about the whip. Climax. Metal King Sword 218. It's, we're gonna need two of those Uber Agates of Evolutions. We'll, we'll, we'll eventually find, I'm sure. Special effects from enemies on attack will deal light damage when attacking, cures a single ally of negative status effects. That's actually really nice. Uh, okay, so let's get a climax, I guess. Agates, actually. It just says the, the Metal King Shield. At least make one of those. Uh, let's see. That's why it said the wood. 5.05 Alright, let's try to make one. Alright, flourishes. Uh, sizzle puff. Sizzle puff. Quadrabash. This cost increased by half. Plus three, but maybe plus two. Make one of them at least. Yeah, we'll take a plus two. All right, what is he got? Um, Sovereign Seal. Oh, yeah, look at all these outfits. I just want to make them of those field marshal finery. Big upgrades too.
Express. So that all the costumes. What's that? Strong strike over two diagonal? Ah. Uh -huh. Perfect. Dum 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 dum. Gotta save it. I appreciate you creeping. Down the save. I'll make all those little nice little gear things. Hendrix won't last long because I'm sure I'll get his other armor here shortly, but I want all the outfits. Flame, yes. Perfect. Beautiful. I love that flame. Get everything set up just right and knock it out. Still couldn't turn out like that, but it's fine. I wonder if that flame lets you last outdoors. You should try that. Where's my flame? There we go. Nice. 
beautiful. Three perfections in a row. Is it tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen? Final Fantasy 20, 16 comes out. And I'm thinking about it. I was like, do I want to stream it? But I'm like, uh, I probably won't have the urge not to play it. Could play it on the weekends, but then I'd have to go all weekend long, not to week long without playing it. Should still be a perfect. Don't jump, 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 jump. Almost done. I got a few other ones to make too. Oh my, so many of them. I'm gonna make them all. I want all the outfits. even easier so you can save it for that right moment didn't know that do now Items to make. They're off to do more story. Oh, I need the cloth. 
wonder where you get those. Um, EQXI Caliado Plus. Where can you get those? Change one serpent souls, uh, Crystallinda and Snuffleheim. Drop some glacial golems at rare, and drop some malicious gray golems at common. Oh, recipe ingredients. You can make it too. No locations, post game, family, humanoid drop experience 4,000 gold, 18,000. Find one of those. You can make one of those, I guess. Well, well, make what we can. Dragons. I suggest royal dragons of the ruins of Dunder Shell. Uh, two mobs that spawn pretty frequently and easily steal killable. If not here, then there's a group of three to four of them at the, uh, stations for killing also. Got 30 in about five minutes. Steal plus flee, repeat. Crystal end out the serpent's soul in your pockets? Me? No. <laughs> Alright, so. I hope that doesn't go over right now. I ah, will just do this. Oh, what a waste! Did it. I was afraid. I was afraid. It's alright, it'll take a plus two. Reset, but I'm not that worried about it. Circuits. I guess we'll, we'll test this theory out.
I have two diagonal. Go across. I mean, either way, I'll still get it. Get a plus three. It's all right. All right, we got ads coming up. Uh, I'll continue crafting until uh, back <laughs> one more. I didn't get one of my flames at all. That was sad. Ah. Uh, TR. Uh, Crimson Knight we need as well. Why is everything for Zavando? Where do you get Crimson Knight now? New Hexai Crimson Knight. Oh, come on, I take that. So, beat all the trials, got the ultimate sword, not that I needed it, but awesome. Um, I need Crimson Knight and Black here. To get these, first go to Galapagos region, use the North Galapagos camp, and make sure you're way to the end of the cave, and you'll find face enemies called these guys. They seem to have better chance of dropping the Serpent Soul compared to other dragons. It does many of them, head to the Snuffleheim castle and talk to- Ah, uh, okay, I see. Okay, so we have to farm those things eventually. Alright, let's see. All. We need Field Marshal and General Boots. Cutter. Or we just do two two. Double bash. Double edge. Do is there, is there a triple edge bash? Still get a perfect to have that. I 
think we have one more. Besides the two things we can't get for Savando yet, but... Savando's make it difficult. So we need to go... We will eventually have to go find some uh, serpent souls. I got it in there. Love that flame. I think that might be it. We'll have to check one more time. Princess Chance. Yeah, I had that one before. Scarlet Slayer. Ah, the swimmer.
Dark damage reduced, chance being curse reduced. Got the Swindler King. And the Spiky Swindler King. Nice. Alright. All dude. Nothing new for you. Veronica. Nothing new for you. Actually, hold on. Veronica, do you by chance have a new outfit? You do. Oh, that one. Goody two shoes? You'll get her a black piglet one. Um. Okay, that's it for now. So Vanda will do as he is. So for now, uh, we are going to go to Port of Valor and do some story. They would need a rest too. So deeply injured. The speech well tells you as it injured. Senor, please wait. These other chambers are done, Rodrigo. He is recovering from an injury at the moment. Is this is your business truly urgent enough to warrant disturbing his convalences? Convalences? See, I okay. But I must ask that you not distress Don Rod Rodrigo in any way, por favor. Time to go see Daddy. Hi, Daddy. Hi, puppy. Hi, puppy. Caramba. Caramba. Norberto, you dare to show your face in my presence. And you have come to tell me something. See? I, I'm so sorry, puppy. Sorry, 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 sorry. So, so sorry. <laughs> sorry? <laughs> What are you apologizing for, foolish boy? Huh? Huh? You have become the knight in smiling armor you spoke of, see? You have made the whole world happy. Hmm. <sighs> Without all his... Not boys. Yet, Papi. Then why are you here, hmm? Why did you come back if you have not yet done, as you promised? You promised you would do this, Norberto. You gave your word. I did not raise you to be a failure. How dare you come to me and... Papi! Damn you, boy. If I were younger, I would put you over my knee. Kind of a knight makes an oath and does not fulfill it. Wait. Papi, did you say knight? You still think of me as one? 
You have no idea how... Oh, thank you, Bobby. Thank you. Thank you, Bobby. I guess it wasn't very knightly of me to come back before I'd fulfilled my promise, huh? But I had a but good reason. Erdwin's lantern, see? Yes. Great evil is afoot. I feel it. <laughs> I feel it too, Papi. We all do. And how can I make people happy if that thing is up there making their lives miserable? It's impossible. Which is why I'm going to do something about it. Only then can I fulfill my vow and make all the people of the world smile again. But there's just one teensy weensy little thing we need to ask you. We want you to help us. Don Rodrigo, an ill wind blows through the world. We would call upon your wisdom. We would ask for your aid in banishing the darkness. <laughs> you walk in here after all these years and start asking oh, favors funny. before you even say hello, Hendrik. As clumsy as ever, I see. Very well. You shall have my aid. If I can help you to erase the dark star from the sky, I will. Oh, Papi, really? Como no, Norberto, of course. A knight serves the weak untiringly, even if they are his son and his former pupil. I have just the thing to toughen you to a, a great trial that has tested the skills of knights across the generations. A great trial, Don Rodrigo. For you to call it such, it must be a test indeed. Oh, it is. <laughs> you have been to Heliodor, see? Then you know the King's Barrow. Two golden giants dwell in its darkest depths. You will defeat them. But... Mere victory will not suffice. No, you must show true unity, true chivalry. You must perform the executioner together, and with it strike the final blow. If you succeed, you will be rewarded with one of the most powerful weapons ever created. With that weapon to aid you, not even the greatest of evils will stand in your way. Oh my, that sounds like quite a prize. Very well, Papi. Challenge accepted. <laughs> you always did have enthusiasm to spare, Norberto. I hope it will be enough. I will open the King's Barrow for you. After that, you're on your own. All right, we're going to the King's Borough. Executioner together, and with the strike, the final blow that fells each beast. However, in order to perform the greatest of techniques, Hendrik must first learn to perform hatchet man and hacks. Nabarto must learn to perform metal slash with the sword. If they succeed, they will be rewarded with one of the most powerful weapons ever created. If you wish both, I wish you both luck. My ah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so you gotta do this with both of them. Fight the grums. We're gonna have the game. Yada yada yada. Uh, make sure Hendrik is prepped up. Eric is on your team, and you have a pet, pet pip or pet pop in one of their inventories. The hero is a good candidate. You won't need more than one, but it's good to be safe. If you want to be safe, you can equip some Earth Elemental Debt Protection. Uh, your starting team should be Hero, Eric, Serena, and Rab. Go to the room and approach the twin Golden Cyclops to begin the battle. Each has 3,000 experience. 
We need to finish each of them off with the pet power executioner. That is so gross. This means we'll need to time the actions accordingly. Executioner should land anywhere between 700 and 1200 HP, depending on your gear and levels. Which means we need to get them into red before calling Savannah on Hendrik. They will likely, most likely, attack normal. Yada yada yada. Set blunt wrap should be the uh, attempting to land sap. Yada yada yada. So we got to make sure we do this. Get them red. Have these two pepped up. So we're gonna have to do some pepped up power outside to get them all worked up. Sounds great. Do I have any peps? I should. That one serpent soul. Pep pop. I have six. Peps up all active allies. Consume farmers. Wow. Swap Hendrik and Spandor in place of the hero and Eric. When Hendrik gets his turn, unleash Executioner. Take it out. Swap out Hendrik and Spandor for the hero and Eric again. Repeat the other giant until the critical HP. Swap out Spandor back in. At this point, you'll use a pep, pep or pop to get Hendrik back to the pep state. Otherwise, you're going to need to spend the turns defending. So you only need to get Hendrik in there? Well, we're gonna go. So it's Hendrik that has to initiate it. Alright, so what we're gonna do. Stop. Line up. Hendrik. You, you, Coasted, let's see, what a Costa Valor campsites. I think we need to go Emerald Coast. We gotta go Emerald Coast. Uh, we need to pep up Hendrick and then we go down here we gotta do this. Okay. Find me something. You are a dragon type, right? Okay, here. 
Here we go. Red dragon. Kind of wear him down a little bit. Love knocking him down, don't you? Oh man. <sighs> I might want to use someone else. We don't want the dragon. On your feet. Thanks. Something weak. That little goblin thing over here. I need yeah. something. Doesn't freaking. Nope. Ah, we will have ads coming up. Oh, he's prepped. Cool. Who go back to save him. <laughs> You'll save and head on in. Alright, so uh, another set of ads. I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. Let's go. All pepped up. Good to go. Run into the King's Burrow. Yeah, run away. I haven't been here in a long time. So we got some golden giants to fight. Fight them one at a time, it says.
They seem to be asking if they're here for the trial. Uh, they seem to be... I am. They look ready for the bitter end. Yes, that was... Hey, Foosh! Hey, thanks for the bits, buddy. How you doing? Now that I'm half at bits, no mercy. Yeah, I have to have some degree of mercy because I have to do this correctly. Alright, tactics. Follow orders. Okay, so. Uh, fight! Uh, yeah, do a pep power. Alright, abilities. Uh, what does it say I recommend? How you been, Frush? It's been a while, buddy. Sword dance. Tweedle Doom and Tweedle Death. Stop. Yeah, work for me, uh... They've been... Damn it! Failed. <laughs> I gotta reset. I wonder if I can leave and come back in. Heavenly wind, uh, yeah, so work's getting um, a new owner. A new company's taking over. So I'm hoping good things happen with that. Oh, what a hit. Whatever. Who else wants some? It's fine. I'll try this again. At least I can retry. <laughs> Thank you again for the bits, man. I appreciate it. Your support has been very helpful. Alright, so we're going to follow orders. And fight. Bit of flash. Hendrick. 
Sabando. You have my soul. Spells. May heaven's yeah. winds propel thee hence. Commissioner. Damn it. All right. All right. Actions. Abilities. Sword dance. Abilities. You're not gonna like this. Spell. Oh, God, it hurts. Thanks. Yeah. Oh, I almost feel bad about this. Well, there goes Eric. I owe you one. Got pepped up and got smacked down. You'll soon be feeling right as rain. You're not gonna like this. Silvano takes the stage! Oh. oh, come on! You knocked them both down? That's stupid. I swear if <laughs> I'll be back up next round.
Oh my god, that crit. <laughs> Scare the shit out of me. Should have them. It's okay. Come on! I swear to God. All right, we got to take him out real quick. Yeah. Oh my goodness gracious. Is there anything I can get? Alright, buddy, get up. Don't you dare lose that. I would be so mad. I'm kicking a man when he's down. Pep thing. Are you serious? Fuck. Well, this isn't good. I don't but that's fine. But wonderful. Kept knocking me down. Not bad, Mr. Hero of Heliodor. My papi taught you well. I do not need your approval, minstrel. But you did not do so badly yourself. Your father was clearly a constructive influence on us both. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Speaking of Papi, where is this amazing weapon he said we'd get for winning, huh? Hmm. <gasps> yep. Hi. Don Rodrigo. <laughs> da, 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 da. Ah, so, you completed the trial, eh? Caramba! I was convinced your weaklings would disappoint me. Don't come the haughty night with us, mister. You're the one who lied about us getting some special weapon for taking your stupid trial. It was no lie. You have the weapon. The greatest weapon of all. He oh, and what is that supposed to mean, huh? Stop speaking in riddles and hand over the goods, will you? Don Rodrigo, this weapon, it is not fashioned from steel or bronze, am I correct? That is correct. <laughs> Muy bien, Hendrik. Your reward for completing the trial was the experience of collaboration. Collaboration with one's brothers in chivalry is a knight's greatest weapon. Trust in your fellow knight. So Put loving. your faith in him as he does in things. you. Do so, and hidden strengths will reveal themselves. Together, we are more than the sum of our parts. United, we can stand against any foe, overcome any mm. obstacle. This is the gift I give to you. What the? We have been booted. Learn chivalry skills. 
Their fraternity skills. You have taken the first steps on the path of the night. But you have far to go. Perhaps if you lean on one another enough, one day you will make it all the way. <laughs> Who's your daddy? Hey, you can't just say that and leave. You have to join us. To join you? But I cannot. I, 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 I cannot. Uh, uh, weren't you the one just giving the speech about knights needing to stick together? Three knights are better than two, no? Oh, and my beard of a I voice. I seem to remember you saying something about doing everything you could to help us erase the dark what star the from the sky. You're probably hungry. I'm so sorry, Vitamin. Knight's word is his bond. It is. Ugh. I'll feed you right after this. Join us, Don Rodrigo. With your mastery to guide us, we shall surely be unstoppable. Join you on your quest, but call for my aid and I will be there. Just do not call too often. Savannah and Hick now use who's the daddy pet power. Alright, with that, I have two seconds, I gotta feed the cat. I'm sorry, you're probably hungry. Getting fresh water, too. I'm so sorry, little one. I'm being neglectful. I'm late tonight, but it'll be alright. Alright, so we have new stuff. So, first things first. Um zoom in over to a campsite to redo skills. Uh let's see. Savannah so just came family more useful, lady first, which is a nice ability. Uh you can have a buffed up jade get two use of multiple feet. Uh, you can call on Veronica for a spell twice in one round for a big damage, especially in enchanting echo activates. And when Veronica learns magic burst, you can loop them more quickly. As for Hendrik, it's not best suited as tanks for upcoming boss battles. Almost literally. By using Forbiddance, Hendrik will soak up all incoming damage to the team. With the right gear and st strategy, he can nullify many incoming attacks for tough fights. You also need to learn Steady Fast Forbearance to make it, this work properly. It's great to reduce the amount of damage Hendrik takes while using Forbearance. Forbearance. Forbearance, whatever. Uh, I'll dish out some decent single target damage during boss fights. Uh, this ability allows you to take some of the toughest enemies in the game without breaking a sweat. See both characters' pages under spells and abilities, and Ponium section for a if you want a visual. So, rectification. Savando. Swords. He reses. Keep swords.
Keep knives. Like reset knives. damage taken on my using working board. Pep up. Pep up power up. Increases the bonus afforded by pepping up. Nice. This one. Brilliance. We could use ladies first. There it is. Fingers of justice unleashes the power of righteousness on a single enemy. Alright, where was that one? Uh, grandstand, the showy shout of chivalric pride that pumps up the declarer's attack. Oh, hi! You tell me, Webby. Might as well get it. Buddy, he's what all the way up in the south. Um, probably would get rid of swords. I got one in sword. I got rid of great sword. Who in great sword? Pathy gives 30% of the HP to an ally. Wow. Resurrect your fallen ally with 100% success rate. He gets Kasing. That's for many forbearance. So we need that one. So that's what we're beeline him for. Axe has got to stay. Can't really do much with them right now. We're slowly gonna make our way over there, I guess. Ah, already. Okay. Wound up. All right. So we're eventually going to get that. Um, I can probably knock out a lot of my shields and pick it up real quick, but I'm beeline for it. Steadfast is probably locked in place right there. Uh, let's see what it is. In addition, you can obtain a Corza de whatever by returning to Porto Valor and speaking to Cervantes. And this is a new outfit, so and a decent piece of armor for him as well. Personally, it's also my favorite. Oh, okay. Back to Porto Valor. How do I save it? Let's go get a new outfit. Next is to work on forging the one of the best swords in the game since we obtained the recipe for it. That first trial.
So, I might go ahead and respec him, get rid of the shields, and slowly work it back up there. Get that forbidden, forbidden, whatever, for Hendrik. Did indeed, thank you very much. Were they represent reward for Poppy? He's prepared for you. Ooh, alright. Uh, this was Don Rodrigo's favorite outfit when he was young. He, a young hombre. Indeed, it's the outfit chose for the wedding day. Now that you have proven yourself worthy. <laughs> Three toys are the best toys. The Dawn. Oh, yes. I love it. He needs charm, anyways. Definitely got the higher charm. That's a nice outfit. I love it. All right, so. Forging the Supreme Sword of Light. First stop in line of events is Galopolis, the original Sword of Light, not the Super Sword of Light. It's one of the required materials to forge the Supreme Sword of Light. So I need to obtain the Forging Hammer, Verified Ori Calcum, and Crucible Keys. All over again, the grid it. Absolutely love it. So Galopolis it is. You should take the time to fill out the beastry areas in the Galapagos region while you're in the area. This is nothing new at the revolving emporiums. You will encounter huge purple brucellas wandering around the principal peninsula. Where you fought the Slayer of the Sands early game. You'll need about 35 or close to 50 if you're a bleachness serpent swords to forge some of the best equipment in the game. While these guys do pack a punch, this is the best place to obtain serpent souls, as the uh, Purcell is a common item and can be easily stolen. These are multiple wandering around, making it easier to encounter them. They respawn almost immediately after defeat, make it very easy to fight them. Uh, very susceptible to being knocked down, so just use Jade's Leg Sweep to be able to reduce it. But I highly recommend obtaining at least a few Serpent Souls for now. Most of these new dragon type enemies found in Act 3 have Serpent Souls to obtain. I'll point out that when we travel. Um, okay, so we do need to go get that. So we'll go get this hammer first, then head up there and start getting a few of those souls. Kid, what are you? Oh, <laughs> I was like, it fell. Did I not? This guy should have a question. Right Oh, that's right. I didn't have this quest. I could have swore I picked this thing up before. This was one of the first quests. Walk on the wild side quest. There it is.
auf. Okay, so there's a quest in here for the prince. You bring him a pepper tree branch. Ah. Alright, so we already got the Galopolis uh, treasure in the wall. Alright, let's see. Uh while you're in his chamber, check the bookshelves for another of the books we need to find the wisdom of Warrior King Quest. I don't think I have that quest. Can I skip over that? I have to go pick that up. Oh, yeah, we did. Lapia Snuffleheim. Oh, okay. Let's see. Feel free to complete the quest now. It should only take a few minutes. Call uh, Celestia, head to the first forest whale station. Look for the golden sparkle spot. some horse racing to get back our forging here. Ah. So I got a few things to do. to zoom over to Galapagos Northern. We go fight a couple of these things and try to get some of these uh, serpent souls. Uh, probably look around 10 for now. I hope. We got nine. We got one on me. Eric in here. So I can 
steel. Do these two. guys are wild side eventually. And pop 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 and pop and pop pop so these are the guys I gotta kill? for loot drops. Ow. 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 Thank goodness. Nice. One. Uh, that puts me at eight. I mean, two. We need uh, eight more. Another. Things are looking up. Drop chances now. Oh, you spawn quick. I do get a lot of these things. Hey. Hey, no.
Alright. It recommends 30, but we're gonna go with like 10 right now. Ow! Cat, go! Wow, what do they do to still alive? Fifty total. If you want to, Let's go. if you're a completionist, but thirty-five. Yoink! Oh, I failed to yoink. Oh my God! God, he just whacks Veronica. the poor child alone. <laughs> by the music in the overworld that you're in the story. Yep. Fighting for some serpent souls. Well, that was easy. I'm trying to get ten of them. I need four more. And then, uh... Proceed on getting the uh, the mallet. Ooh. How you doing, Jericho? Oof. Oof. Funny thing is that music in the whole land is from DQ3. It is. Burn, buddy, burn! And I... Oof. 
Didn't realize that until this playthrough. <laughs> We win again. And Cess uh, Cessia's music, um, I think it's from 4 or 2 or something like that, I forget. But it's old music as well. Alright, so I uh, need 3 more. I lost count. Yep. 3 more. Thing you do is I always do more. They put a bunch of tunes from the others in there. Yeah, I know I did that from the, the first time I played the game. <laughs> yeah, I just got done doing Hendrix and uh. Savando's uh, quest to upgrade their skills. Seems like it's a lot easier to level in this game than the other one is. Like, than the other uh, Dragon Quest game, the original. What's yours is mine! Yeah, this is Definitive Edition. Ow. Because around this time, I was like maybe 50-something. Now I'm like almost damn near uh, um, high 60s. Drop your items, man. Uh, like two more. Oh, it looks so good, Loth. What's up, buddy? I am well. Excited for uh, 16 to come out tomorrow. It could be delivered tomorrow. Um, I did see the preview for uh, Super Mario RPG. Looks good. Um, Gino, I think, is uh, a little dull. It's actually good to actually be able to see some kind of creature. Because the old style, you could tell he was a doll, but you couldn't really tell what he looked like. Hmm? Oh shit, you automatically run into that? That's not good. What do we do now? Oh, God. It's gonna rock me. Oh, mine too. I know the first time I played that game, I didn't want to beat it. I would always stop playing right before I got to the end. Uh, because I didn't want to beat the game. Because <laughs> it'd be over. My mom's played that so much. She'll definitely want to play it. Oh, me. Yeah, for sure. I think it's the last one. Even 
Smash in the original. Yeah, and it looks amazing. Bakos did a preview on it, but I looked up. Uh, uh, I don't know why I didn't mean to do that. Um, there's some other things they're doing as well, but that's all I heard about. Oh, yeah. See, attack on all enemies with a pair of boomerangs that can make them more susceptible to status on. Oh, oh, man, more ads. Uh, quick ad break, guys. I'll be back. Um, I gotta warp to a camp real quick. I wanna be in a safe spot. That should be 10. Back to Galopolis. Show you the Jericho. Good boy. <laughs> He's getting big, Jericho. He doesn't have the multicolor eyes, but he does have nice, pretty blue eyes. Yeah, the belly rub. Mm, he's super lovable. Loves his kisses. Loves his belly rubs. Yes. Oh. He's so sweet. Oh, there he goes. He's active right now. Alright, so, back to Galapagos. We'll come back and get some of those afterwards. He's a sweetheart. My mom came up today to say hi to him, and he ran away from her. Because he couldn't remember. Like, when... Just like a week ago, she'd come up, we'd run to her. Now he's like, nope, don't know ya. Oh, thank you, look. I got called. So, work had a mandatory meeting. New company's taking over. And, um, so we went over a few things, and I'm, I I have good hopes for them. So, they're going to have much better 401k. Oh, I love the house, man. I absolutely love it. Baby bits have a little touch of color in his nose. A uh, little bit. Ears. And see color on his nose. But, yeah, if he's got tan, it's probably right here. His ears and the tip of his tail. Let's go into the bathroom. Yeah, he's not pure white. But it's fine. Yeah, you would think so, but his daddy was a black cat. Solid black and his mom was calico. Now, Siamese, two of the siblings look like Siamese cats. They had the blount, the... The tip nose, the black tip ears, the black tip tail. Uh, a guy at work picked up two of the kids that look just like them. Um, you, you good kitty. He tries. <laughs> I think that's my poop voice. That kitty. Yeah, so I don't know where he get, they get the Himalayan aspect of it, but because mom was a calico, dad was a solid black cat. There's I have no idea how a white cat and those Siamese looking kitty cats uh, came into play. That's true. I had to get a blood test done on him. Never done. Unless it's a pure breed, the calico and generic domestic short hair. Can have a mix of breeds in them. So possible. Hey, come here, Vita. 
Good kitty. Good kitty. Yes, he got a little brown right there. He's got little brown tipped ears and a brown tipped tail. Oh, that's not his tail. That's his tail. He's talking about that. And he comes when I call. He's a sweetheart. You missed it one day. Um, he come up and he just laid right on my, you know, jump down. Are you, are you going to try to make that? I don't, you're going to fall! <laughs> oh, you can't jump on something that has a curve. You'll fall, you sweet little shit. Alright, go for it. So, I was streaming on Kick and Trovo, and I'm leaning back like this. He's laying on my chest and my shoulders, and he climbs on and lays right on the top of my hat. I need to go back and get that video so I can clip it. But... Yeah, he's, he's sweet. He's very friendly. Comes when I calls him. He's a good cat. Didn't want the cat, but I got the cat. My mom wanted the cat. And I was half tempted to get one of his siblings, which is uh, Calico. One was like a really dark Calico, so it'd likely to be a female. But having two cats is a. Yeah, I got three and a half. Trying to get Magic and Zoe to accommodate the little one. He stays in my room 100% of the time. Uh, I'm trying to get him used to the other animals, but Dallas keeps trying to eat them. Like, day one, Dallas decided, hey, guess what? I'm going to put you in my mouth and hold you there. Oh, he's kind of a little afraid of Dallas. So we got a couple of tracks to win. Platinum Cup. We have to win. I have the thing of unlimited stamina, so I'm cool with it. Ugh. Yodge! Ah! Oh. That's a thing there! So, yeah, it took me almost two weeks to get him to use the bathroom, to use the letter box. He kept pooping behind my high kitty. Uh, he kept going behind my desk. And you know, I tried to put him in the letter box. I had to get this kitten to track um, litter and put a little tin pan behind my desk because that's where he likes to go. He actually went in the pretty letter the other day. So I'm hoping eventually I can convert him to the pretty litter. Hello.
Yeah, but he hasn't gotten a chance to explore the house yet. Mainly because of Dallas. I have a gate on my door and it's blocked off at the bottom. He can still get out, but... I have it there so... He can slowly see Dallas and Dallas can see him and the cats. Pushing buttons. Ah, wow, where'd you guys get that stamina from? Stop. Oh, no, lose. I'm gonna lose! Oh, I won! <laughs> I won, I don't know how. That was... But I'll take it. False teeth like stars, they come out of night. Ha ha ha. Uh, let's see. Good line up. Hendrick. My guy. Jade. Equipment. Guy stops right. My sword's better. Okay, so we have to go now go to the battleground. Um, we got the forging hammer, still uh, sky steed sword is nice. Great sword that can remove buffs. Um just make your way to campsite B4. And there's nothing new here. If the, there are sparkly spots you want to pick up, yada yada yada. Um Are you telling me I should have the? Oh, do I not have the battleground? I don't. Oh, that's a shame. All right, looks like we're flying. Get back to the, uh... The Melissa's Right Prince will only appear on the upper levels. Separation for a tough battle ahead. Equip two Venus Tier 3s to Hendrick. Um, Metal King Armor. The setup will nullify wind damage. Uh, let's see. It would be best to equip the rest of the team. The Mass plus 3 as well. You should have them from earlier in the game. Do not. Right into the battleground. Kind of sucks I don't have the uh, teleport, but that's fine. Whatever. Uh, Good out of the teleport. What's doing, little one? Well, might as well grab the sparklies while we're here. One, two. Gotta go down, 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 down.
before or not before. All right. Get the campfire now. So, make your way to the locked door in the southern portion of B9 to fight a new B Street entry along the way. Yes, this big boy. Uh... Passionary Lee Valley, Disciple Tears, Stock of One. Or Calcum. You'll need to do about 15 or so to forge everything in the game. Wow. Uh, also, in the cavern is a chest with the um, new book. Finish up the battlefield area and then call it there. in here, so... This was one of my first fights I died in on the original one. Alright, well this guy is supposed to be pretty tough. 5,000 HP, it's not too bad. Uh, actually, it's not the dragon, so it's fine. Where are the cabins? Our cousin as well as yours. Trust contain a recipe book, Way of the War Goddess, which also allows you to forge Minerva's tiara and the criminals. So great in the opposite to you. We have help though. So we gotta find the chest and get the artwork done. Ow! Last time I fought him, I had four potions. Ow, you are. You're not nice. Ooh. You get 
three. Good job. Hey, <laughs> killed him with a hip bump. treasure chest which is the way of the war goddess also and the cavern is a chest before you head out pick up the b5 where's this chest though like up here You didn't specify, it just says in the cavern. There's a lot of fucking cavern in here. You fucking move? in this cavern. It specifies that particular cavern. There's a chest down there we already got. There's a... Come on! I ran out of time here. I got two items to get. So this... supposed to be a chest? Oh, it's right there. Nice. Okay, so now we need to go get that or right, calcum and then uh, get out of here. Stop. Don't eat the remote. Don't step on the remote either. Can't get through there. Alright, get on. You're new. Now I gotta fight you. Come on. How can this be? He literally has a dragon salt in his hand. Oh, 
Ow. Kind of hurt. Ow. Wonderful. Verified or calc. All right, and with that, let's get out of here. I'm going to zoom over to Helidor Region's campfire. Rest up, save up, and we will pick this up tomorrow, guys. I appreciate you hanging out with me and stopping in. You want to say bye, Vita? Huh, vitamin? You want to say bye-bye? Are you too busy playing with stuff? All right, so, save, and we're secure. Guys, have a good night, and girls, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Later.